Hello everyone and welcome back to my Ultima 4 playthrough. We are here at Scarbray where we left off last time. We were looking for the horn. It's not on this island. And we keep running into things that, um, you know, that we need, that we need a boat for. And I think we're going to try to take care of that lack today. Let's bring up the map a little bit. So you can see we are over here. It's Scarabray, far western side of the map. And what I want to do is that we'll travel by Moongate. And we will go to Lord British's castle to um, uh, get Iolo his level and who, anybody else. I think Iolo is the only person that's due for a level. And pop into Britain a little bit and buy some food. And then we're going to take the uh, moon gate down here and, and grab the one south of Trinzic. And I want to thoroughly explore the area of the Cape of Heroes. I, I just got this feeling. I don't know if it's something I read a long time ago. I've not done any research on it recently. But I'm feeling like this is a place where ships may congregate. So... I want to go down there and look around. We know there's supposed to be a shrine down there someplace as well. So let's do that. Maybe we'll talk to Hawkwind and just see how things are going on our on our report card, see if we're getting any better on things. Some things I, I know I'm not because I haven't, like I need to buy reagents and pay full price, and I haven't been anywhere to buy reagents in a while. So, all right. So let's get down to it. From here, we got to go back to you. That's the easiest way to get to Lord British's castle. We have to take a connecting gate, as it were. So we will wait here until we can get to you. Actually, we don't have to wait hardly at all. Okay, and now we will uh, have to wait a little bit until we can uh, take the gate to Lord British's castle. Okay, we have successfully let us let's let's get our commerce out of the way first of all um, and I also want to I am at full health let's go down here talk to this person I am not in need of help sure nope yes Okay, so I've done that twice. I'm down to 300 health. That's okay. I wanted to do that there before I... Um, before I... Went and talked to Hawkwind. Because that's going to help my compassion score. So we'll see what happens. May I interest you in some rations? Yes. 40 gold pieces. Holy crap, they are expensive expensive here either that or get they're get, i don't know if they're getting more expensive because they're bigger food packs i don't know why that well, i don't know why the food packs size would increase given the number of people we have we're consuming it faster so i don't know maybe it's just i don't know that's a lot um i could have sworn it was like 25 gold pieces here before and maybe i should start mapping that all right, I'm going to start keeping track of that. I'm going to start uh, seeing if the food prices are changing and how much they are. Okay, so I got we do have a lot of gold. If I bought 10, 25 for only. So if I bought, how many packs of 25 would I like? If I bought four, that would give us 100. We have 148. Four times four, uh, 160. Let's buy eight. We get the gold for that. Nope. All right. Let's, uh, are we, our business here is done. Let's get out and let's talk to Lord British. And Hawkwind. Let's see Lord British first. 
and actually he can uh, he can heal me ooh that's handy I could really grind I could really grind the compassion we'll have to see oh, I gotta climb um, because he will heal if if I ask about his health and so I could just you know go back and forth may I won't do that on camera man that might be a, a quick and easy way to get my compassion score up <laughs> let's talk to Lord British all right Iolo is now level five nope yeah yeah and Joffrey and Julia got a little bit of healing too so yeah I could really I could really uh <laughs> grind that out all right well that's that's good that's a good thought i hadn't i hadn't thought about that that i could just do that but let's see what what i i have done a bit of that since the last time we uh we talked to hawkwind so let's see uh how much of a difference that has made uh some of these things i don't think are going to have changed as changed at all but but um can't hurt it can't hurt um, so, okay. All right, good. I am awake so I can talk. All right, so honesty. Uh, thou art a thief and a scoundrel. Okay, that hasn't changed, and that's because of the whole buying, the whole buying thing and, and playing, paying less. Um, so that's fine. Um, I didn't expect that one to change. Compassion, I'm hoping, I was at a four, and I'm still at a four. So I haven't done it enough to improve. I'm, I'm still the same. All right. Valor. Thou art showing valor. Okay, that's also a four. And we, we rose to a four last time, but, but now we're still at a four. All right. Justice. Unjust wretch, which is the lowest you can get. That hasn't changed. All right. So lots of uh, staying the same. So far. Okay, sacrifice. Sacrifice. Thou art giving of thyself in some ways, seek ye to find more. So that is also the same, which was, has been no change. That's a four, so that's second highest. All right. Honor. Thou dost not fight with honor, but with malice and deceit. Ooh, I think that's an improvement because we were at the very lowest end. We were a cad and a bounder. We were low as a slug. So I think we've I think we've gone up a rung. So that's good news. Very good news. Spirituality. Thou art doing well on the path to inner sight. Continue to seek the inner light. That's the same as it was last time. Okay. And then humility, we were told we're ready for elevation. Yes, and that has not changed. That has not changed. Okay, so basically we're still the same way we are. Our honor went up. So that's good. That's good. All right. Meditate for three cycles. All right. You guys are all sleeping and I got to drag your sorry butts. All right. Now everybody's awake. All right. Good. Um, I think we're ready to go to go on our trip. So yeah, we can go to Trinsic right from here. That's excellent news. So let's sleeve this. Go back to the moon gate here. And 
take it down the Trinsic area, and then we will head south and explore the Cape of Heroes. Okay, here we are. So we're just going to head north. If you remember, the Cape of Heroes is kind of like a claw, and we're just going to go straight south here. We'll follow the coast, and we'll explore that part of the claw, if you will, which is right here. So we can already see the split of the claw here. Um, and, you know, if this doesn't take us very long, then uh, <laughs> and it's not, uh, then we will continue to do some other exploring, maybe get up into the spirit wood um, and just just do some exploring around. And, and of course, we're going to have things to kill. And, you know, that's to be expected. All right. Only three of these guys. I'm liking the odds. Let's move him over. I'm going to move over here. You can stay put, you can stay put. Come on up. These guys are so slow, it might be a while before we can get our little, our melee guys can. Uh, get some, uh, get some hits on them. All right. All right, Joffrey. Oh, I, I keep meaning to, to switch. Joffrey and um, Julia's weapons. Maybe I'll do that when we're done with this. Although we've got rogues to deal with who steal our gold. Oh, that guy is fleeing, I think. I don't think I can get Iolo up there to get that fleeing guy in time. I might be able to get there myself. Nope. Ooh, there's a couple guys here. Uh, I'll have Iolo do it. He's got nimble fingers. Well, maybe not so nimble. <laughs> After all. All right. One rogue. I like these odds. Now, if we can just fight this guy without him taking my gold. Well, that was easy. All right. Um, oh, I don't know why I'm having these guys. I guess we're taking practice swings. All right, I'm going to back up. You guys can come up. You can come up. You can come up. Attack! Hey, that's one of those guys gone. Excellent. Little, little rock throwing SOBs. All right. I'm going to move over, actually, my next turn. So, because Iolo can handle that guy, but I want to. That wasn't a rock. I don't know what that was. Maybe it was a rock. It didn't look like a rock. All right. Now we're we're in the thick of it. Hot and heavy. That troll says he's fleeing. For a guy that's fleeing, he's just kind of standing there. All right, he's gone. All right. We're whittling him down bit by bit. It's funny, this feels so much better than last episode where I was just wandering around and fighting stuff. But you know, this time uh, we're just exploring and of course there's gonna be crap out here that we need to kill because that's the way the, the wilderness is, but. It's not as frustrating because it's not preventing me from getting where I want to go. This is where I want to go. All right, Julia. I don't remember. I should look and see how close everybody is to their next level up. Um, 
because I might want to do a little strategy there as far as who's doing what. All right. All right, or uh, is, I don't know if this guy's fleeing. I'm not sure what he's doing. He doesn't look like he's fleeing. Maybe he is fleeing. He's just, no, I don't know what he's doing. All right. Let's see if we can get into a position to take this guy on. He's not in a great position for me or Iolo with our rangedness to get in there. I'm guessing he's not fleeing. He's just really bad at... There we go. I think I'm going to have to sit this one out pretty much. It's just it's not going to be room for me the way he's positioned himself. There we go. Oh, the gold. Uh, sorry, Olo. Yeah. 28 gold. All right, cool. We're building up all that gold. All right, so now let's check out the other claw here. Oh, there's a shrine. I'm trying to remember which shrine it was. Let's see. Lies to the south and west of Trinsic Bia. That This is the Shrine of Honor that we are looking at here. The Shrine of Honor. Okay, so that is um, that Shrine found. We've only got three that we haven't found. Um, we haven't found Honesty. And we haven't found Compassion. And we haven't found Humility. Humility and honesty we need a ship for in order to find that. Okay, so let's continue. I'm not going to worry about going there because we're not ready for elevation yet. Um, but let's... Well, we got more things to kill. All right. Let's get her done. And we'll go down and we'll, we'll go down into the... Um, into the other part of the crab claw there. Trying to get everybody into a good position. And I'm in a bad position. You can stay there. You can stay there. Get up there, Julia. Iolo, soften him up a little bit. Oh, he's already heavily wounded. Excellent. Oh, interesting. He's sliding around. He's he's taking evasive maneuvers. Done. And we got more. Oh, we got more of these baddies. All right. So let's get our melee peeps up. And we can start with the attacky tacky. At least Iolo and I can. Maybe we can thin their herd a little bit. Okay. Swing! I didn't. I didn't switch her weapons. I said I was going to switch her weapons. I did not switch her weapons. All right. I get down and I get, you know see the gold and I get thinking where to go next. I move Julia up. All right. Attack. Attack. Uh, I'm attack this guy on the left or the right. Okay, so we're 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 making progress. Oh, I didn't want to do that. He could attack the guy next to him. Trolls fleeing already. Wow, that didn't take very long. Get up there. Oh, I, I, I fat fingered. 
Took care of the troll. No double teaming. That's not nice. Ugh. Oh, the, we got somebody escaped. All right, down to one. He's lightly wounded. Still lightly wounded. Well, he can't escape. We've got him boxed in. Some, okay, now he's heavily wounded. He think he's fleeing, but there's no place for him to go, so. All right, get, I guess I will. I was hoping to get away from this headless, but I'm guessing that's not gonna happen. Okay, only one. Liking the odds, liking the odds. I'm going to leave you put, you come up, kind of create a funnel of death here like we did last time. All right. He's heavily wounded already. Beautiful. Let him run our gauntlet maybe, or else we'll just kill him outright. All right. Get me. Get me. We're already up to 600 gold again. All right, so here we are. We're down in the big part of the Crab Claw. And there's nothing here. I don't know why I, I, I'm I'm having this need to go out to the absolute tip of the claw so we can see you know so we're looking out at the Cape of Heroes right now we've got a the, we can see a little bit of, of an island there's a there's a few islands down there uh, one of which is the um, you got Serpent Castle on it not that particular one that we could see all right so let's continue our exploration here uh, I we've we've kind of come down the the eastern shore, so let's go along the western shore here. We've got a lot of mountains. Hey, we have orcs and an Etten. Beautiful. All right, I'm gonna attack. And I guess Iolo can attack, and he's going to miss. Lightly wounded. Yeah, Etten's throw the rocks. I mean, they're not super strong, so I'm not worried about, you know, using a fireball or something on them. But at the same time, I find it aggravating because they can they can throw them in diagonals whoops practice swing for Joffrey and I still didn't switch their bloody weapons all right we got one down I'm gonna come over here and see if I can take out that troll and you can come over and break ranks you can attack you come over here and take on that and I'm gonna move over attack you can wait a sec attack attack yeah focus on me big boy and I miss all right no you don't have a target Joffrey barely wounded Okay, we got an orc that's fleeing. Here, we're de dealing with all the damage that we're getting. Barely wounded. Missed. 
I didn't really want to move ILO, but I did. Well, yeah, that's fine. Joffy should be able to handle this guy. And Iolo can help me with the troll. Now he's fleeing. I feel like these trolls are just fleeing really fast. Okay, the Etten's lightly wounded. There we go, he's gone. Alrighty then. I'm gonna move you up. Oh, he's fleeing. Or is he? Still fleeing. For a guy that's fleeing, he's not moving. <laughs> he's probably trying to flee like in the direction where that orc is at and he can't move because the orc was there. Gone. All right, so now we got a couple more of these orcs. If we could just clean them up, then we're done. Are you fleeing? That one's fleeing. I mean, chasing them really isn't worth anything. All right. I'm not sure if this guy is... No, this guy is not fleeing. Now he's fleeing. I don't think I'm going to get a shot at him before he... Oh, I am. Got him. Get... Iolo. 21 gold. All right. All right, just orcs. I ain't afraid of no orcs. And we've already... there. There's one gone. There's one gone already. All right, back me up. Wait, wait. Get in line. Let's see, Iolo's got a shot. Wait, wait. When I melee guys wait. And we'll pick them off from the back. Or we'll dismiss. Part their hair with our rocks. There we go. Heavily wounded. Good job, Iolo. Lightly wounded. Less good job by me. That guy is gone. Another one bites dust. They do have a, an orc infestation problem here in the land of Britannia. You know, they should, like, get Orcanex to come out here and spray their nests or something. Because, you know, nobody wants to live in a land with a bunch of nasty old orcs in it. Right? I mean... Who wants, who wants orcs in their garden? You know, driving down the property values. It's just, it's not a good thing. It's not a good thing. All right, if we can get rid of these last couple, that will make me happy. There we go. Good job, Joffrey. All right, we've got that guy. He's fleeing now. I think uh, Shamino and Julia can just, just, just relax. They can chillax for for a little bit. All right, he's gone. So we are down to one. Between Joffrey and Iolo, they ought to be able to handle this. I'm gonna stay out of it. I'll let them get some XP. All right, get. Uh, I guess me. All right. I think I'm going to hole up in camp here, and I think I'm going to call that an episode. Um, we've we've explored the uh, Cave of Heroes, and we're working our way up the western coast, and uh, we didn't find any ships, unfortunately. I may have to actually do some actual actual um, research on that, but but my but my gut feeling that 
that I was gonna have that I was gonna find a ship there because what we want to do is find a ship and then fight the crew and then we get the ship, which hopefully won't disappear for us like our horse did. But I'm gonna let that be that. Um, I'm just looking at my gold total. <laughs> I hope that doesn't bode ill for us next time. But thank you for watching this episode. And I do hope you come back for the next one. We'll have to kill something else to redeem our demonic gold. Have a good one. And until next time, be seeing you.